Thank you very much for that. Thank you very much for that. Welcome to Dublin Gathering 2018. Hello, Jodie Roberts. How are you? I'm alright. I'm, I'm a lot cooler than I was this morning. Yeah. Are you hot this morning? Oh, it was hot. boiling. It was boiling. I was worried the wind was going to take over. But thankfully, it's just a nice temperature. It's very, just to sound very English, it, it's very pleasant right now. Now, I have a question, obviously. Mm. How do you let go of a <laughs> How do you just say, do you know what, I want to do stuff on my own? Um, well, I, I do an awful lot of uh, different stuff, so uh, the answer is easily. Yeah. I'm not wishing to sound like I've done for but yeah, just, it's... Um, I can yeah, understand I why you would, I have met <laughs> Yeah, you need space. Um, yeah, so the, the solo stuff is there, I do a duo, with, a bit of duo stuff with him, I do a bit of duo stuff with uh, Rob Maddock. Uh, which is the VNR stuff, uh, then we've uh, got a couple of band projects, Rosa and, uh, and Hanfist. So it's, uh, it just keeps keeping itself busy really, so yeah. And you're on VNR? Yeah, I'm on VNR. Yeah, it's just been announced as doing some kind of tour. Oh, that's great. Yeah, so we're going to be playing at Night at the Abbey. Night at the Abbey. Which I'm really looking forward to actually. We're, uh, we're going to rock the Night at the Abbey. You better do. We're going to wake people up. They, they were, they were, they were going to go there. You're going to wake up the souls of the Exactly that. The, 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 the old bishops. We, we, we're going to bash the bishops. The dead ones. You heard ones. it here first. They're going to bash the bishops. <laughs> now, I noticed you're wearing a Fida t-shirt. I am. Big what fan. did it feel, when you saw that your name was directly under Fida, what, how did you feel about that? Well, I had to pay Mike quite a lot of money to make sure that was there. And, and even then, he didn't make my text big enough, in my opinion. But, uh, no, it's... Uh, so you are, he, he, needs his, he needs his name written bigger. Yeah, yeah. That's his, his, his next demand. It was... Um, I, well, I, I was chuffed to get the play Godly anyway. And then when I, I, I actually... I think I'm... No, which way round did I find this out? Did I find out I was playing and then find out if you were playing? Can't remember. But uh, they, they are one of my... You know, one of my favourite bands, uh, certainly live bands. Anyway, I've probably seen them, I don't know, five, six, seven times. So, to, to That's get almost all for levels. Yeah, yeah. Right, but you're almost there. Yeah. Well, to um, to get to see them for free, in effect, as well, and you know, and get to play this uh, double bubble, as they say. Right now, um, for the next question, you have to hook a duck out of the pool. Oh wow. Okay. Do you and want to hook the duck to them? You need to hook me a duck. I have my two daughters with me, seven and five. Please do nicely decorate Oh, wow. Get, get the black and red one. The Harley Quinn one. Oh, oh Harley Quinn. Good. Cool. That's it. Right, what number have we got now? Right, what's the question? Let's have a look at the bottom of the duck. Number one. Why wouldn't oh, it be number first, one? First question. That's because Harley Quinn's number one. <laughs> right. Oh, this is an easy one. Is it? You've got to complete the film quote. Oh, no way, go on. You're going to need a bigger... Boat. Where's it from? Uh, Jaws, the first one. See? I knew it was going to be easy, but we have to ease you in. Ease, yeah. Ease Pick another in. one then. Pick another one, go on. Pick another one, anyone. Oh, we got Harry Potter in there as well. Oh, who have we got? Oh, Who's that wearing a... What's he wearing? A tea cosy or something. <laughs> Is that? That's uh, the 14th. First and last question. Yeah. Right, to my book. The numbers aren't in there then. 14. Yeah. If you could be any world leader for a day, who would you be and what would you do? Well, I'm going to sound political for a second here. I would be our Prime Minister. Okay. And I would reverse Brexit. There you go. <laughs> well, I'd just reverse Brexit. <laughs> and then I'd leave. I do, a, I do a David Cameron, but in reverse. You have to, you have to be careful when you say that, because you said I do a Brexit and leave. What we want to yeah, do... Yeah, good point. Yeah. So you said you want do, to stand. Yeah. Well, hang on a minute. We're all allowed double negatives now, apparently. Right, okay. Shouldn't, wouldn't, couldn't, as Trump would give you, so... Yeah, okay, I think I... So, so you would reverse Brexit? Oh, 100%. Now, uh, for people watching, where can they, if they're not here, where can they find your music to listen to? Okay, I will be on the acoustic stage, which is in the bottom field. Uh, we've got a GFM stage opposite and the acoustic tent, and I'm on at quarter to nine. Quarter to nine. Quarter to nine. Right, you heard it here. Quarter to nine at the acoustic tent, Bam Baxter. Thank you very much for Georgie, thank you very much. It was Great. very lovely to see you.